Ear infections cause pain. We know that we cause they cause fever, and they cause that little membrane in the ear to bulge and stretch, and and then the child will pull at their ear. They might cry. It depends how old they are, and that's when we often see them come into the office. And we find when we look at the eardrum, it's very red and swollen. Some eardrums are so swollen that they might burst, and fluid might come out of the ear. And that's a bit more complicated. So when do we treat ear infections? Well, that depends on a number of factors. The more riskier ear infections are usually if the child's a younger age or they've got the really persistent fevers, usually beyond 48 hours, they're from an indigenous background or they have a cochlear implant or they've got lower immunity, then we might consider antibiotics early or as I said, after 48 hours, we might introduce antibiotics to treat their infection. If they've got mild symptoms, or they're a little bit older, past the age of two, and they can handle the pain with some Panadol, then we might not use antibiotics. And it's really important to make this point because in big studies, antibiotics don't really make a big difference to the duration of the ear infection and don't actually make a difference to the complications of that ear infection. So overall, managing with Panadol can be a really safe option.